Hello everyone, my name is Jordan and this is the Amazfit T-Rex Pro. Amazfit is not a brand that a lot of people will think of when they think of high-end smartwatches. The T-Rex Pro doesn't sacrifice quality for price, but how good can it really be? What kind of features does this offer and who is it for and what can you expect once you get it? Well, let's find out. It has a 47 millimeter polycarbonate case matched with a 22 millimeter silicone rubber strap, all weighing in at 59.4 grams. So the T-Rex Pro is light watch thanks to that plastic case. There's also a chunky bezel with exposed machine screws to emphasize its rugged credentials. And it's passed military grade tests to make it better suited for the outdoors. The Pro attains 15 military grade tests and is built to handle extreme humidity and freezing temperatures. Along with those improved military grade toughness credentials, it's also ramped up the water resistance rating, offering protection up to 100 meters of depth. At the heart of that light, rugged, chunky exterior is a 1.3 inch AMO LED touchscreen display, which can be set to always on. Tempered glass and an anti-fingerprint coating that's used to make it more durable and smudge free display. It's a bright and colorful screen with good viewing angles. In bright outdoor light, web vibrancy isn't quite as punchy as in more favorable conditions, but it's on a whole good quality display to find a watch at this price. Around the back is where you'll find the optical sensors and the charging pins for when you need to power things back up again. It uses a slim charging setup which magnetically clips itself in place and securely stays put when it's time to charge. The T-Rex Pro goes big on sports modes and includes the kinds of sensors that should make it a good workout companion. There's 100 sports modes up from just the 14 included in a standard T-Rex. It still covers running, cycling and swimming, pool or open water, but it also adds profiles for activities like surfing, dance and indoor activities like Pilates. The majority of these new modes will offer you the basics in terms of metrics through modes like surfing and hiking will offer additional ones like speed in real time. The addition of an altimeter here means you can capture richer elevation data, which is useful if you're a fan of getting up high and hitting those mountains in hilly terrain. If you're happy to stick to the basics though, the Pro does a good enough job. Along with manual tracking, there's support for automatic exercise recognition for eight of those sports modes. On the T-Rex Pro, you'll need to select whether to automatically track activities like running, swimming, and indoor rowing. Zepp's Health BioTracker 2 optical sensor is included to power a host of heart rate features outside of continuous monitoring and measuring effort levels during exercise. It's also used for the PAI scores, which seeks to shift the attention away from counting steps to regularly raising your heart rate through exercise. It's also used for taking heart rate variability measurements to track stress levels and is used for training insights that will generate VO2 max scores, training effect, training load, and recovery times. You'll get those staple activity tracking features here too, such as capturing daily step counts and monitoring sleep as well as naps, capturing sleep stages and breathing quality, which is tagged as a beta feature and makes use of the new onboard SPO2 sensor. Google, Android, and Apple iPhone users can view notifications, control music playing on your phone, along with setting up alarms, reminders, and changing the watch face. If you don't have payments, the ability to download apps, a music player, or a smart assistant, which has appeared on some Amazfit watches, but not this one. Notification support is of the basic kind, letting you view notifications from the native and third-party apps, but not respond to them. They're easy to read, but what you can read varies based on the type of notification. If you happen to have multiple notifications from the same app, it struggles to display them all and merely lets you have multiple messages. Music controls work well as they do in other Amazfit watches and features like weather forecast and watch faces are well optimized to that touchscreen display. Zep has countered the benefits of the Pro's model additional sensors and functionality by reducing its quoted battery life by a couple of days to 18 days. While the magnetic USB charger isn't the most well designed, it does refill the watch with surprising haste, breaking past 50% in 30 minutes and fully recharging the T-Rex Pro in 75 minutes flat. All in all, the Amazfit T-Rex Pro represents a modest upgrade from the original T-Rex, with additional features like SPO2 tracking and a far greater width of sports modes than its predecessor in a package that's not only marginally more expensive, but also has a lot of improvements. The improvements to the hardiness, heart rate sensor, and water resistance push the Pro from a good to great value offering. However, it's not perfect. The software and stats it can track are relatively self-contained, with no third-party app support or wider ecosystem to interface with, plus more premium features like an integrated speaker, user accessible storage, and interchangeable straps aren't on the table here. If you want an affordable, fitness-centric smartwatch that can hold its nerve in the great outdoors, the Amazfit T-Rex Pro is a good fit for you. If you want a watch that can talk with other fitness services and deliver the full platter of smart wearable features, Zep's latest tough offering might not be for you. But that's just my opinion. Why don't you let me know your opinions in the comments down below. Give the video a like if you learned anything and maybe hit that subscribe button if you enjoy these types of reviews. 
If you want a little bit of a smartwatch that still won't break the bank, but want a more compatible Apple smartwatch, why not check out this video on the Apple Watch 3? You might find something more for you there.